Good day, you groovy geeks. Welcome to another episode of Gizmos and Gags, where every week I show you a gizmo and a gag. Domino. Let's get it going. So if you missed my premiere episode of Gizmos and Gags, check a link in the description. You might like what I did, you might not, but I'm having fun getting some cool stuff to show you. So let's get started with today's gizmo. It's the Bell & Howell Tack Light. Now you may have seen this advertised on television. They call it the most amazing flashlight ever invented by man. I don't, I don't think they exactly use those words, but they have a lot of claims for this guy, including how bright it is. So let me get some batteries. It's one of these uh, one, two, three, looks like AAA battery holders. Load some AAA batteries in this baby. And put this guy back in like that. And go ahead and close it up. And fire it up to be pretty bright. It has an adjustable lens. Let's see, how does this thing adjust? And yeah, I talk about how it, uh, the lens adjusts. I don't really see much of what it's doing. Oh, oh, it pulls out. Okay, so you zoom in, zoom out. So like you can do like a little point like that. Zoom in, zoom out. It appears to be pretty bright. Um, but you know what? They claim you can run it over with your car, you can freeze it in, uh, in ice, or freeze it in water, which will become ice. Uh, so I'm gonna do those tests. So let's take a look and see how this Bell & Howell tack light performs. So the first test was to run it over. So I laid it near the front tire of my Jeep, fired up the Jeep, and ran over this flashlight. Now I noticed it just blinked for a second, but other than that, it survived. Now onto the waterproof test where I dropped it in this bowl of water and the flashlight stayed lit. The extreme temperature test of dropping this in boiling water seemed to not phase the tack light, nor did the other extreme temperature of freezing as I put it in the same bowl of water and froze it. Flashlight still on. Well, it survived. So it uh, definitely has good seals and a strong enough uh, case to avoid crushing. Uh, in, a, in addition to the regular mode, this also has a couple of different modes. I think you press and hold. There we go. It's got a, a strobe mode. See that? And then I think it's supposed to have a SOS mode. There we go. So it'll signal SOS. And this thing is like 25 bucks. Uh, they wanted, you know, they, they do the deal where they'll send you two uh, for 25 bucks. So for 12 bucks, it's not bad. I'd like to see uh, the long range battery life on this, but it's the Bell & Howell Tack Light. And uh, that's today's gizmo. Now on to our gag. Now when I saw this thing, I just had to have it. I mean, who wouldn't want this? Who wouldn't want to have this as something they have hanging around in the house? Here's our gag. It's the electronic yodeling pickle. Come on, you know you want this. You know everybody wants one of these. yodeling All right, let's see what's inside the box. It's gonna be a pickle. Pretty sure it's a pickle. Uh, appears to be the same shape as a large pickle. Apparently this is indeed a pickle. Oh, and it's got the uh, fun little pull-out tab. I love these little pull-out tabs because you pull it out and you're ready to go. Ready to go to town. Tab is out. I see a speaker and a button. All right, I'm going to press the button on the pickle. Oh, 
I told you you couldn't live without this thing. The electronic yodeling pickle. If, so if somebody could tell me what went through the thought process of whoever it was that thought about this. I mean, they even have the cute little character of the, the pickle guy on the box. Uh, with a stein of beer and wearing some suspenders and a hat. <laughs> That's the pickle. pickle. Uh, looks like it takes some uh, some button cell batteries inside. Uh, and that... That's why it's called a gag, okay? Don't get too serious about it. It's an electronic yodeling pickle. All right, so that is this week's... Wait, don't go away because you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna give away this Bell & Howell tack light to one random lucky fan. Why not? I think I'm gonna do that every week on gizmos and gags. I'm gonna give away a gizmo, give away a gag. There's a comment pinned in the comments below. It's from me to you. It tells you how you can enter for your chance to win this Bell & Howell Tack Light, and I will send it off to you. Thanks for watching Gizmos and Gags, you groovy geeks. See you next week.